tell me he is not a genius. Hey guys, what's up? It's Zach, back with another vlog. It's been a few days, but studying for these exams that I have coming up has really been knocking a lot out of me. So, I got here earlier today. Actually, I got here like an hour earlier than I would have because, thankfully, my class got out early. Anyway, I get here and my friend Nathan, he's already here. Or, no. No, Nathan showed up later. But when Nathan got here... Hmm? Oh. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, right, I already have one. Yeah. Snickers. I got Snickers. Yeah. Anyway, Nathan gets here after I get here. And he tells me something that I... Afterwards, I kind of felt like an idiot for not seeing it, but... It happens to everyone, so no big deal. He was saying how the Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. show on ABC is an extension, or at least has similarities, to Firefly. And I just thought, yeah, I, 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 don't, I don't really see that. But then I started to look at it. And, okay, look, look, look at these similarities. Zoe, a very powerful female character, Agent May. A very powerful female character who is also close with Coulson and in Firefly Zoe is close to Malcolm. Hmm? You sticking with me? If that doesn't convince you, you have Ward, the tough guy on the SHIELD team, Jane, the tough guy on Firefly team, the two youngsters on the ship, Fitz and Simmons, who, in the last episode, they seem to have a little bit of a romantic thing going on. I'll get to that in my next Fantastic Caps episode. But also, in Firefly, the youngsters, Simon and Kaylee. Hmm? Hmm? And you have... I actually didn't see this, but... I didn't pick up on this, but in the... Not last episode, but episode before that, Sky says, things just come naturally to me. In Firefly, it's brought up that things come naturally to River. Before all of that, and from the very first episode, like, if you guys watch my Fantastic Caps, I, like, freaked out when I saw Shepard Book on In Shield. Of course, not a Shepard Book, but still. He was there. Then in the next episode, Ward pulls out that blue staff looking thing that emits the blue shockwave, identical to the one Simon uses in Serenity. I didn't see it, but I really should have. Well, okay, I saw it, but I disregarded it because I just thought that was too ridiculous. But it works. I know one person who hasn't really gotten into Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. much. And I really hope she'll watch this video because, Katie, I'm talking to you. If you watch Firefly, then that is all the more reason to get into Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Okay, guys, come on. Don't be doing that. A couple of the, couple of the other volunteers at the Youth Center here are there. They're interfering with my concentration. And trying to mess up the video. <laughs> so I think I might have to go now. That and I've got some studying to do. Like I'm going to be doing all the weekend. Except on Saturday when I'm going to Halcon and I'm going to meet up with Jewel State and Yaya Han. So that's going to be good. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Keep on keeping on. And watch Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. It's awesome.